Mr. Richard Piazza. His other car is a 1200 horsepower C7 we've done. Beautiful blue C7. He just purchased a new 2021 C8 Corvette. In this video, I'm sure you'll see us install our stainless steel C8 catback exhaust system. We also do just a drop in air filter. There's no really uh, cool air boxes actually available yet. Um, people keep saying two weeks, two weeks, but even with those, I don't know how much they'll really gain. We'll test one eventually. But for now, drop in air filter with our stainless cat back. Car sounds awesome. Is you today? Yeah, this is me. You got a new C8 with titanium exhaust. Uh, no, I don't think it's a titanium as well. Wait. Need turbos. <laughs> what? You got Anthony laying everything out. What's up, bro? Everything was uh, nicely packaged. If you order one, this is how you're going to get it. It's going to be all tightly bubble wrapped. Did you run into any snags yet trying to install this? Is this your first C8 exhaust install? Oh, no, 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 no. How many have you done? This makes number... Well, if you count how many times we took the other one. <laughs> that looks sexy as hell, don't it? It looks better if it was titanium. Oh, yeah. Uh, I, I like I, it. I agree. Uh, I like it. The titanium is it's sick. sick. I, I know. This still looks good though. This still but looks good. This was missing two clamps, so I filled two clamps out of inventory. Okay. Once I'm happy with the tips, I'm gonna remove so they can go in here. Yep. And tighten. How, how, how is fitment good? I'm being serious. You can say it on camera. As far as putting the, these on. Well, the, yeah, it's fit pretty decent so far. Okay, good. It, with the flex couple jobs, because now we have two, one on each side, and then the way. Or you, the, we had the slip fit here. Yeah. The old ones didn't have the slip fit here. There was just one yeah, piece. Just one piece. Mm -hmm. So it's easier, right? Yeah. Word. Because you can put those in there without mm -hmm. the mufflers and stuff on. Yeah. All right. Move oh. them around, leave them loose. That's the trick. Is you gotta leave them loose. You get this situated and because, like I said, you just did TJ's twin turbo one, so it literally didn't have those slip fit. You know what I mean? Yeah. It was just all one piece. Mm -hmm. That was our one of our first designs from 2020. Right. Way different, right? Oh, yeah. I figured that that should be a lot easier to... Mm -hmm. No, I, I like it. It won't rev up this much. When they're cold start, they rev up. Uh, ready? Yeah.
so bone stock we make three pulls just back to back to back with hot 421 415 417 what did i say 417 417 right 417 417 I know there was a 407 seven. i think was the average and then air filter in our exhaust check out the gains guys insane torque insane horsepower gains 446 448 449 and then 435 436 438 if you average these three up average these three up average these three up average these three up 30 rear wheel horsepower gain and 30 rear wheel torque gain in my opinion phenomenal for just a cat back and an air filter and this car now sounds like a true exotic muscle car. I love it. And I know Mr. Piazza's gonna love it too. Hey, give me the exotic sound with it. Give us a call. We have our stainless steel catbacks in stock as well as our titanium C8 catbacks in stock ready to ship today. So give us a call or shoot us an email anytime. Let's show them that titanium. Oh, so we do have these in stock. I've already opened this box, but when y'all get it at home, if y'all do order them, Everything comes nice and packaged. This is our titanium system. This thing is super uh, light, titanium. Welds look beautiful. Everything's TIG welded. As y'all can see, the beautiful color in it. And the longer you drive these titanium ones that we install, you'll see the beautiful color from purple. Actually, goes like blue, purple, yellow, and it, man, it looks awesome. On all the CAs we've done, the X pipes going all the way out to the tips turn colors after customers beat the living crap out of them. The sound quality you get from a stock CA Corvette sounds good. You have the factory dual mode NPP. Some of these customers think, it, you know, it does sound a little bit better when you open it up. In my opinion, night and day different sounding with this muffler system and the X-Pipe that we designed. It sounds like a true exotic V8. Can we show a uh, close up on the welds? Yeah, as you can see, everything is TIG welded. This isn't no MIG here. There's a lot of, I think there's a few other systems out there that are for sale, that are MIG welded. They just do not do it justice. And again, guys, we do include all hardware. Those of you that want to install it in your garage, you can do it yourself. Uh, just know the whole rear bumper and a few other pieces have to come off to get to the catback exhaust system. We do it every day, so it's not that big of a deal for us. Those of you guys mechanically inclined, you can for sure do it yourself in your garage. Got a question for you, boss man. Out of the other systems that are out there and people that have complained about the drone, does this one have the drone or is this one a lot Dude, better? I'm, I'm not gonna lie. I've driven a lot of cars with Corsa, Borla, Magnaflow, Acropovic, you name it. Other cars have drone like old C6s and stuff. This car has zero drone on the highway. We do have muffler systems on it. Like I said, with the X-Pipe design, it's hard to describe it. Like even in the videos that y'all will see, it sounds awesome, but until you actually hear it in person, night and day and there is no drone on the highway like going eighth gear at 1200 rpms you can still talk to your significant other or your whoever's in the passenger seat uh, without having to yell at them even without having the dual mode system on it i put this on my personal car over a year ago and i absolutely love it see what it really sounds like Another question that's come up frequently on the C8 catback exhaust system, is there a difference from going the straight pipe, straight pipe to the muffler? Does one have a drone so, okay, so more kind raspy? Of, so kind of going backwards, yes. So there are systems out there that are cheaper than this one that look kind of similar. A, they're MIG welded. In my opinion, they look like junk uh, compared to TIG welded and B, we include a muffler system with ours, with our X-Pipe, and the muffler makes it sound, like I said, it, it sounds like a exotic sounding V8, where a non-muffler car, I don't wanna say it sounds like a dump truck, but it sounds more like glass packs, like a dump truck. We just weighed the stock exhaust, and it weighs 67 pounds on that one. They're actually a little heavier. Yeah, it's we're holding it. I think, I, I think last week it was like 72, but because we're holding each end, yeah. maybe we got a couple pounds. Partially together. Here. Put everything in and yep. weigh the box. Yep. And we are at zero. Dirt, that, that's less than half the weight. Yeah. 
less than half the weight. And that's, and that's in the, the cardboard box. box. Yeah, that's what the box, that's with all the clamps, which the other one didn't have the clamps. I mean, that's what, the box everything. is less than a pound. Yeah, the box ain't, but all the extra clamps, I mean, take it back off. I mean, just the V-bands. I mean, I know it's not a lot, but watch this. You know what I mean? You get a couple pounds just from the accessories. Ooh, that's five pounds. Just the exhaust itself, you're talking 30 pounds versus almost 70 pounds, that's insane. Yep. Cool. So that's the benefit. And one of the other things we wanted to touch upon is some of the guys like to try to go with the straight pipe versus having a muffler in there. Now the problem with that is you gotta yell to have the conversation instead of being able to just talk on the phone like a normal how, how you're doing, still have a phone call and you don't have that drone raspy yeah. sound like a glass pack. With the muffler, you got the look, you've got the sound, you've got conversation quality, peace of mind, because you're not gonna get a ticket. You shouldn't be talking on your phone while driving your car anyway, so. Nope. <laughs> 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 Let's go check it okay, out. Okay, great. That's the, that's the least part of the expense. Let me change the place. <laughs> I know. 